Oski, you already went up on social media and said, I deserve all the criticism my way. Um, why, are you, why are you in here uh, talking? Uh, first off, I just want to give, take my hat off to the Rams. They did an excellent job tonight. And, you know, they, they won when it mattered the most. And, uh, I mean, for me, uh, it's tough, but it's a moment. A lot of athletes I know dream of just being in this moment. Tie ball game, you can make that game change and play. And for me, that's something I was thinking about all week. I know I can make that play. And when the play came up, I ain't make it. And I know that was a, a big play of the game, a big opportunity for me and for the team. And as a player, I mean, I, I just feel like I let my brothers down. But I mean, uh, for us, like, we didn't we didn't play how we needed to play. We left a lot of fields on the play, and obviously my play was a, a crucial one that I left on the field. And I really wish I can have it back, but I mean, at the end of the day, like like I said, take the take your head off for the Rams, and you know they came in and and did what they had to do. The ball the ball hung up there. Yeah. Is, is there any sense that you overthought it? I mean, it was it was almost too easy for you. I mean, nah, man. I'm, I see it. I'm like, oh yeah, he he fucked up. It's, we about to win this game. And when it hit my hands, I thought I had it. And then it just, I don't know how I dropped it. Like, I didn't drop a ball in practice all week. Caught everything that came my way. I mean, it ain't too much you can do to practice practice a moment like that, you know? And the only only time you, you get that moment is when you get it. You know, for me, it's a moment of truth. And a moment of truth showed, and I, and I didn't step up. And for me, like, I, I made... I made a game-winning layup in high school, like game-winning interception in high school. So for me, it's like I know I can do it. You know what I'm saying? So for me, it's like being at the highest level of football. Even even when I was little, you can you see those guys make those plays for the team, make the the big time interception, and it was like I can be that guy. And when it was in the air, I'm like I'm gonna be that guy, and I just didn't come up with it. Oh, uh, I mean, hell, it was still six minutes left in the game. Like, no time to put my head down. You know, I, another opportunity could have came up as well. So for me, it was just like stay locked in and, I mean, keep fighting. Your teammates have already been in here talking about how one of the reasons that you're in this game is because of your play in Green Bay. How does it feel to have that support behind you? Uh, I mean, that's just my brothers being my brothers. But I mean, for me, like, I'm hard on myself. Like, like I say, I, I got high expectations for myself. So that play, as a player and where I'm from, like it, that's a play I should make in my sleep, and I didn't make it. That's good. Sorry, I understand that you're focusing on that one play because it just happened. But when you look at the season and everything that you went through with your brothers, how much can you be proud of? Uh, very proud. I mean, early on, a lot of people counted us out, and it wasn't gelling as a team. Well, I won't say it wasn't gelling as a team. It was just we didn't. We didn't have our I think we didn't have our identity then, and I mean, and it showed. Like I feel like we lost some games that we shouldn't have lost, and you know, as the season went on, we found our identity, and you know, we we hung our head on that, and you know, we did some good things. And we even got to the NLC championship. So, I mean, I love the guys in the locker room, man. I I know what they're about. I know what I'm about, and I mean it. For us to get to the NFC Championship and all the things it took for us to get there, I mean, it's a heck of a year. In a game where there's like 60, 70 plays, it feels like this feels pretty naive to blame one play that the drop is talking about. That has a reason you guys lost. But um, third downs, it seems like you guys gave, I think, like 70% of third downs. What was going on with third downs? Why did you guys get off the field? Uh, I mean, like I said, uh, for us, we, as a defense, you know, we didn't execute as much as we needed to. And I mean, like I said, get a get a Rams credit. They, you know, they came with a game plan and, you know, they executed more than us. Like a lot of things that we was giving up was solely on our defense. And, you know, we hang our hat on just make teams beat us by by making them make mistakes versus us giving them mistakes. So like I said, I mean us versus our defense, you know, Bussing, bussing coverage, stuff like that. Uh, you go back to the Green Bay game, you know, the first drive, 
we we take it we took it as hey we gave them seven points we can shut this team down and I mean that's that's just been our defense all year like when when the team score hey no more like that's just that's just what we've been all year. All right, thank you guys. We got Debo.